Hey there, Leo. This is Renee and welcome back. Leo, this is going to be your reading for March 18th through the 31st. Okay. And when I was meditating on your energy, I got the Ace of Wands energy. And I believe Gemini was also another one that got the Ace of Wands energy while I was meditating. Um, so you may want to take a look at the Gemini reading. Uh, but I feel like something is being manifested. You're taking action on something uh, that is going to, you know, create some kind of shift, Leo. Um, so I feel like, you know, there's something incredible that is in store for you during the month of March. Okay, um, something that you're actively working on, something that you're actively bringing to life. So let's go ahead and get some more clarification from the tarot cards. <clears throat> See what is coming forward for you, Leo. Okay, so we have the Six of Wands. Success, victory, something is coming forward. The Nine of Cups, beautiful, something that you're manifesting, you're bringing to life. The Nine of Swords, okay? We have the Wheel of Fortune and the Hierophant, okay? And the Ace of Cups. What did I tell you, Leo? I feel like you're you're manifesting something big. You're, you know, you're coming into this time to where, you know, you are becoming a success. You have victory. You're being recognized. People are looking at you and thinking, how did Leo do that? How did Leo make that happen? Okay? So I feel like there's certain shifts that are going um that are happening for you at this moment. At the bottom, we have the Ace of Cups. So I feel like there is something that you are leaving behind. You're not even focusing on these cups. You're just focusing on that one cup, that one good idea, that one good situation that you've been hoping for, that you've been wishing for. And I feel like this is the one Thing that you're focused on that you're focused on bringing into life okay <clears throat> so I feel like there's a lot of clarity you're getting you're gaining a clear understanding of what this is that you're trying to make happen what this is that you're trying to focus on okay and I feel like you are you know you're really putting in the work you are not stopping you're not backing down from the situation. You're moving forward. You're gaining momentum. Okay? So I feel like, you know, big things are happening for you, Leo. Um, with the Six of Wands, the Nine of Cups, and the Nine of Swords. I feel like you are definitely having victory in the situation. There's success. You're being recognized. You're going to get some type of reward for the work that you've been doing. I know that you've been putting in hard work. Um, this may be at your job. You may be recognized for the, the good work that you're doing. And there may be a promotion in, in, <clears throat> in your future. You know, some kind of wishes are coming true. This is being fulfilled. This is having your cup full, having the things that you need, okay? And I feel like, you know, you have victory. You have victory over the situation. This is the after tarot, Leo. So, you know, normally the Nine of Swords would mean, you know, fears, doubts, worry, uh, sleepless nights, you know, really overthinking a situation. But here we see that, you know, they're not laying back just wallowing in these fears. They're battling these demons. They're, they're focusing on getting rid of the worry, of the doubt, you know, of the contemplation. And there's this blanket of protection that is covering her. So I, I feel like... <clears throat> And you totally understand that you're being protected in this situation, that you have victory over your fears, that whatever doubts 
are in your mind that you can actually change that and bring forward the the good intentions the good thoughts the good feelings the fulfillment okay and i feel like that's exactly what you're doing leo because i feel like there's a shift that's happening there's a shift that's happening that's bringing good change good fortune um something happening in your favor and i feel like it's because you're totally focused on bringing things to life there's a higher power that's working in your favor right now leo and i'm not sure if you're aware of it or not but i feel like you know spirit is letting you know that you know the higher power is working for you you know it's bringing a lot of love a lot of admiration a lot of contentment a lot of happiness and if you're open to love at the moment i feel like your cup is running over you know i feel like you know good things are coming to you and this may be a good time to you know start that new relationship or look for that new love you just have to put yourself out there and let yourself be known that you are available okay so let's go ahead and get some clarification for these cards for leo and I'm sorry, I'm losing my voice a little bit. So please look past my voice. Um, I've been doing readings all morning. And also, um, other things. So yeah, okay. Let's get some clarification for Leo. Okay. With the Six of Wands, we have the Six of Swords. So you're definitely moving in this direction. And look, with the Hierophants, look at that. We have two Hierophants. Definitely something spiritual working in your favor. With the Nine of uh, Swords, we have the Ten of Pentacles. Okay. With the Wheel of Fortune, we have the Lovers. With the Hierophants, we have temperance and with the ace of cups we have the nine of cups so definitely we have the nine of cups twice we have the hierophant twice um and good things are coming to you leo um i feel like it's a long time coming too uh, but you do have something that's coming something that's very unexpected you're going to receive very good news very soon okay this is going to be an offer this is going to be a gift but i feel like it's very valuable to you this is something that you've been waiting to hear okay good news coming to you leo so that's great look at what's right behind it the ten of cups a lot of happiness a lot of joy the six of wands again success recognition being valued be, being appreciated okay so i i feel like you know this is just the clarification that you needed in order to put you into the right spot because i feel like there's a great shift going on for you leo with the Six of Wands, we have the Six of Swords. So I feel like you're definitely moving into this new position. You're moving into greater possibilities, a better place, a better location. Um, you know, more positive things are happening for you. And with the Hierophant, like I said, I feel like spiritual things are happening to bring you abundance. You know, to bring you contentment having everything that you need, you know, having value, having success, you know. So I feel like it's definitely something that you're working on. You, you've you worked very hard for this situation to come to this spot that you're in at the moment. With the Wheel of Fortune, we have the Lover's card. And with the Hierophant, we have the Temperance. With the ace of cups we have the nine of cups so definitely this shift that you're going through is taking you to better choices better awareness like i said if you're open to love leo i feel like love is coming in very strong it's a very big possibility and look at this rainbow there's a lot of happiness a lot of joy surrounded by this card 
And I feel like, you know, you've been very patient in your situation, but now you're becoming more aware. And you are very focused on bringing healing, bringing satisfaction into your life. With this Nine of Cups energy, I feel like your wishes are now becoming true. Things are being revealed. And you are provided these better opportunities, these better possibilities in your life at this moment. Okay? So that is very beautiful energy, uh, Leo. And I feel like, you know, there's some things about this reading that you may not be expecting, but you are anticipating, you know, happening. Okay, so in the back of your mind, I feel like you know something good is coming. Um, you're just not aware of when or how it'll be appearing in your life. But I feel like you, you already can kind of feel it's on its way. Okay, let's get an outcome for Leo. An outcome, please, for Leo. <clears throat> Okay, we have the Five of Wands. Okay, there may have been some competition. Um, there may have been a lot of building and, you know, um, building up to this point. Okay, um, but I feel like this is also, you've been training for this. This is something that you, you are making happen. So I feel like you have been training for this situation to come into fruition, okay? And with this King of King of Wands energy, I feel like it's very passionate. It's very fiery. And look at all these wands. Oh my goodness. And at the bottom you have the Knight of Cups. So like I said, there's an offer on the table. If you're open to love, Leo, I feel like love is coming in very strong. And you're going to get some kind of offer, some kind of proposal, some kind of gift coming into you of love. Uh, this may also be an offer that you very well can't refuse because it may lead to a lot of wisdom, a lot of guidance, you know, a feeling of being renewed. Okay, um, like I said, I feel like, you know, where there was competition, I feel like you stand out in the crowd because maybe you have been doing training, maybe you have been doing research, but I feel like this new passion that you're coming into, you're putting action where it needs to happen. Okay, you're not just sitting by waiting for something good to happen you're you're making the uh, necessary steps you're going through this shift to where you are um, moving into the situation that you know you're able to take action you're able to really respond to the situation in a very clear light Okay, there may be good news that you'll be hearing very soon. Um, maybe news that you've been waiting for, news that um, is going to make you very happy in this situation. Okay, um, it may be about a new job, a new position, um, maybe someone communicating with you that you didn't expect. But I really feel like this is very unexpected news that's coming through for you. So I feel like, you know, that's something for you to look forward to, whatever this information is. I feel like it's like taking you to this new place. Look at these, you know, uh, the Wheel of Fortune. This is good fortune turning in your favor. And I feel like whatever love is coming in, whatever love is coming in is you know, do, is is shifting you into a new way of thinking. This may also be some kind of choice that needs to be made in your situation that's going to bring you a lot of happiness, a lot of joy, okay? But good fortune, good luck, uh, a shift is happening, okay? And I, I really want you to be aware of this situation. Because when it happens, I feel like it's going to happen 
very quickly. The ball is going to start rolling and you're going to you're going to need to roll with this. OK, um, so don't sit back and and let this pass you by. OK, uh, let's get some monology cards and this one wanted to come out right away. Nothing is yet set in stone. So, you know, uh, things can change. So we want to be aware of the things around us. Um, I feel like being more aware of the situations, the possibilities, you know, is going to really help you through your situation. Okay. Um, because nothing yet is set in stone. Um, I feel like spirit and the universe is still working on this to make it happen for you. But good things are coming. Okay. And we have luck is on your side. Okay, new moon in Sagittarius. So take notice because you are being recognized for the work that you are doing, Leo. Okay, let's get a manifestation monology card. Let's see what's going on with Leo. Let's see what's going on with Leo. What do we have for Leo? Okay. We have step up and lead, okay? Be that true, courageous leader that you are meant to be. And you are a leader. You are courageous. You are fearless, Leo, okay? Step into your power, okay? You have the ability. And we have a new moon in Pisces, attuned to the divine. You know, tune into your, your, your intuition abilities, your psychic abilities, because spirit wants to give you guidance in your situation. So I feel like being more aware of your intuition and following your intuition, trusting in the way that it leads you is going to be very beneficial for you at this time. Okay, let's go ahead and get some angel cards for Leo. What else does Leo need to know, please? A message for Leo. Okay, we have not the right time. So, you know, there may be opportunities that are just not the right time to pursue, but I feel like other opportunities are going to be readily available to you. Okay, we have success. The opportunities that you do pursue are going to be very successful. We've seen that with the Six of Wands at the beginning of the reading. The Six of Wands was the very first card to come out, okay? And we have no need to worry, okay? There's no need to worry because it is going to work in your favor, okay? Let's go ahead and get a angel number. See what we have for Leo. An angel number for Leo, please. What do we have for Leo? Message for Leo. Okay, we have 333 three, three, potential. Your chance to reach your highest of potentials is here. Perseverance has gotten you to where you are. You have been through so much, and this guidance is here to show you that you are exactly where you need to be. Beautiful, Leo. And your affirmation, my potential is infinite. I use my strength as my ally to pursue my highest good. Okay, so beautiful energy. Leo. Now, if this reading resonates, please like and subscribe. Hit that bell so that you don't miss any uploads. Take a look at your sun, moon, and rising um, for full clarity and messages. And um, I have those in a playlist for March, so they're easy to find. And until your next reading, Leo, many blessings to you. Love and light.